currently working in or looking for a career in cybersecurity and want to know what certifications you should take, then this video is for you. I'll be discussing five of the top cybersecurity certifications to help you propel your career. So let's get straight to it. Number one, CompTIA Security Plus. Now on average, this would take around three to six months to study for. Obviously, this depends on how much time you have to study. This is a global certification that validates the baseline skills needed to perform core security functions and pursue a career in cybersecurity. It covers the following areas, threats, attacks and vulnerabilities, identity and access management, technologies and tools, risk management, architecture and design, and PKI. Now, when completed, you'll have gained knowledge and skills in many areas, such as being able to identify strategies developed by cyber adversaries, understand the principles of organizational security, how to install and configure networks, describe how wireless and remote access security is enforced, and much, much more. It's a great certification. I highly recommend as an entry level, you should look at this. Number two, the Google Cybersecurity Certificate. Now this is available through Coursera and they predict this will take around six months to complete if you are spending around seven hours a week studying. Once again, this does depend on how much time you have. You will learn to understand the importance of cybersecurity practices and their impact on organizations. You will learn how to protect networks, devices, people, and data from unauthorized cyber attacks. Be able to identify common risks, threats and vulnerabilities and gain hands-on experience with Python, Linux and SQL. This is a great certification for anyone new or just starting out in their journey within cybersecurity. You will cover all the basic foundations needed. Number three, the Certified Information System Security Professional, the CISSP. Now this is widely regarded as the world's premier cybersecurity certification and it's administered by the International Information System Security Certification Consortium, commonly known as the ISC. Now generally individuals spend between two to six months preparing for the exam. This is assuming they study consistently around 10 to 15 hours per week. The exam itself takes around three hours to complete. Candidates must have at least five years of paid work experience in two or more of the eight domains of the CISSP, such as security and risk management, asset security, security architecture and engineering, communication and network security, identity and access management, security assessment and testing, security operations and software development security. These are the domains covered. Now you may be able to satisfy one year of your required work experience with a relevant four year college degree, or if you hold an approved credential, but this is something you'd need to check beforehand, but worth knowing. Now it's important to note that CISSP certification holders must earn continuing professional education credits and pay an annual maintenance fee. Number four, the Certified Ethical Hacker, CEH. Now this is also a globally recognized credential in the cybersecurity field that can open doors to several career opportunities. It offers in-depth knowledge of the current hacking landscape, including the latest techniques, tools, and methodologies used by cyber criminals. It covers a wide range of topics, including intrusion detection, policy creation, social engineering, virus creation, and more. Now it's designed to test your understanding of how to think, and act like a hacker to better protect systems against them. On average, candidates spend around three months preparing for the exam, but once again, it depends on how much study time you have available. The exam itself is a 125 question multiple choice exam and candidates have four hours to complete. So the CEH certification requirements are less stringent than many of the other popular cybersecurity certifications. So for this reason, it's often considered an entry level certification, but it's undoubtedly a must have for anyone seeking work with offensive characteristics. And number five, the CompTIA Cybersecurity Analyst, CYSA. Now this certificate is for cyber professionals tasked with incident detection, prevention and response through continuous security monitoring. It is recommended that candidates have either Network Plus or Security Plus or equivalent knowledge 
plus a minimum of four years of hands-on experience as an incident response analyst or a SOC analyst or, or something equivalent. On average, candidates spend two to three months preparing for the exam if they study part-time at 10 to 15 hours per week. The certification verifies that successful candidates have the knowledge and skills required to detect and analyze indicators of malicious activity, to understand threat intelligence and threat management, to respond to attacks and vulnerabilities and perform incident response and report and communicate related activity. The exam itself is 165 minutes with a maximum of 85 multiple choice and performance based questions. Now, I hope you have found this video useful. If I've missed any information that you'd like to know, let me know in the comments below. Also, let me know if you're currently studying any of these certifications. I'd love to know. Remember to consider subscribing and press the like button. I'll be uploading regular videos on this topic, plus career advice and interview tips. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all in the next video.